now that I got this working good, it's time to talk to you a little bit about Strix Elixirs. Um, I'm real impressed. First off, I got a thank you card. Thank me. Thank you for making such great juice. Look at this. They even sent me this little bookmark. Here's some Strix Elixirs. I really love their logo. Uh, the stickers on their bottles are just real clean stickers. Um, this is about 60 mils right here. I went with a little variance. Um, they gave me a coupon code to use for taking 25% off my next order. So right off the bat, they're sending me discounts, which is good. Um, it's a high printed cardboard type of material. Um, how many companies go out of their way to give you extra stuff like this? And I know you'd probably consider this just banter and fodder, um, but when you add a little bit of extra along the way for marketing, to me, that sets you apart from the rest. Um, I got a thank you card even, okay? Um, look at that. Congratulations. We hope you love the Strix Juice. The Strix Chicks, you know, handwritten notes and um, extra coupons for my next order. Uh, that's smart moving right there, Strix. Really is. Um, they pretty much sell themselves as pre-steeped e-juice, and right out of the bottle, there's no steeping needed. Um, I'm just gonna burn the rest of this out. Um, I usually change out the cotton, but these are really strong flavors. And since I pretty much toasted this bottle of vanilla ice cream, it's pretty much been my all-day vape, I gotta say lately. Um, my flavor profile, sometimes I like to go out of my flavor profile zone, and I did a little bit, but not too much. Um, I picked up some vanilla ice cream. Um, I like vanilla, like the ice cream, like the smooth, um, and this really hits it on the mark. Um, picked up some banana slam, Got some blue honey, and I picked up the vanilla Bogart. Um, I'm gonna start off right now with opening up another bottle of the vanilla ice cream. They do have these childproof lock, um, what, what do you call it? These uh, protectors so you can't get in the juice. And I just broke the seal, it comes off real good. I'm gonna put the lid back on. I'm not gonna have any problems. So it's nice to be able to break a seal or something. They got the smaller drip tips versus the larger fat ones you often see. Here's just a generic. And then here's the smaller. So if you need to get into small type filling holes, um, some tanks you bottom fill. This is chill for dripping. Um, yeehaw, Strix Elixirs. I'm already impressed and I haven't even gotten to the taste yet. Um, bottle stickers are awesome. I really like their logo. Throwing a note and some discount. Thanks a lot, Strix. You guys are awesome. Wow. That's true flavor. Um, that is definitely vanilla ice cream. I should know. Whenever I go to like Baskin Robbins or 31 Flavors, whatever you call it, um, I just get vanilla. I'm not some crazy taster ice cream guy. I get vanilla. Hundreds of flavors. What do I do? I get vanilla. Same thing with my vape juice. Vanilla. All right, so I'm definitely getting a lot of vape out of it. What do you what do you want to know? Um, vanilla ice cream, yeah, real good, yeah. I got three bottles of it and tore through one. I'm glad I got more than one. Sometimes you take a chance and know what you're gonna get. Now, trying different different devices, it might taste different. Uh, it might taste different in a pro tank or a cardo. C 
use this thing right here. It's got a little squid on it. You really have to futz with the connectors on this thing. Uh, the K100 right off the go is perfect for what I need. But I want to try it on a different device. I'm getting more flavor out of it on my K100. But I'm not really impressed with this mod setup. I gotta be honest with you. I'll probably end up uh, trading it out to a friend that's uh, that's vaping and maybe give him a pro tank too or something with it. But um, definitely want to get people off the of cigs. And if you're my friends and you're you're still smoking, uh, let me know and I'll see what I can do to get you a starter kit or at least maybe some of my old gear that's lying around that I'm not using anymore. Um, if it's going to help you get off cigs, man, I, re I really think it's important. But uh, something like this, not my favorite. The bottom, as you unscrew it to lock it, it unscrews the whole bottom. So I'm just going to put this away for now. Uh, brought it out thinking I could revive it. And this, this just isn't for me. You'll find devices that you like. Um, I really like my eye taste. still broken so I'm gonna try different juices but I'm gonna try it in here Strix this is really good um, Strix elixirs you guys pick some up this is a vanilla ice cream I'm gonna switch it out try a little banana this is the banana slam That's good. It's like a ripe banana. I'm not looking at chips. I'm not looking at mush. You know, that mixes really well with the vanilla ice cream. Yeah, I definitely like this banana slam. I definitely do. Now, the blue honey and the vanilla bogart. As far as flavors go, these are really, really intense flavors. And the blue honey, that's no, that's no exception. Uh, the blue honey, there's a lot of honey in here. And you can definitely taste like a, like a blueberry, little blueberry honey. See, for me, that banana mixed with that vanilla is really good. I like when certain juices can complement each other and you can just pile it on. The reason why I'm not uh, getting this down to nothing is because this blue honey is so sweet for me. The honey is just overpowering. And I like a lot of flavor, but this blue honey... This is a lot of honey. It's a little sweet for me. Um, and to mix the blue honey with the vanilla ice cream, it's good. I mean, I could put a little bit of vanilla on top, but that its sweetness just really grabs me right here. But that blueberry... You're getting a good good blueberry. It's not a powdery blueberry at all. <coughs> and that's the blue honey. Um, wow, that is so sweet. If you're a honey lover, this this uh, blue honey is worth a try. Um, definitely would order the vanilla ice cream again. Um, the blue honey, I think I can make this last a long time where I don't have to order it again. The banana slam, I could see myself running out of it. Um, but I would order more vanilla ice cream. 
up, last but not least, the Vanilla Bogart. This is a, uh, this is a tobacco. This is a vanilla tobacco. And the reason why I'm leaving it for last, it almost has like a peanut butter smell to it. And I know it's probably not very peanut buttery, um, but it's not peanut butter. It's definitely vanilla and tobacco. Um, it's like a dry tobacco. Not like a pipe tobacco or anything, but like a drier tobacco. Um, for me, I'm just going to pat some of this out. I don't know how you guys do it. I'll just pat some out. But uh, this vanilla Bogart is just really tobacco-y. I mean, I could take this vanilla Bogart. And see, that's real strong. That's a strong tobacco. Um, it's been a while since I've had a tobacco flavor. Um, I quit smoking cigarettes like a year ago plus. Went straight to vaping and haven't looked back. Um, and every so often I try a tobacco. I forgot what a cigarette tastes like. I mean, I, f I can't tell you what a Camel or a Marlboro or a Crush or... I can't tell you what a cigarette tastes like anymore. I just remembered that I used to love them. I love them so much. I would smoke in the shower. I'd smoke before I wake up. I'd smoke in every time I'd have coffee. Um, this is a different kind of, this is more of like a, like an elite kind of, kind of tobacco. I, I hate to say it, but these are a little bit more overpowering for me than these two flavors. So much, in fact, that I could keep adding the vanilla ice cream three or four times when I run out in here and still taste the heavy tobacco. So I would probably do one to four drops. One drop here to four drops of the vanilla ice cream. The vanilla ice cream is a great base for all these other flavors to bring those flavors out and to nullify them a little bit. For me, they're a little bit tad overpowering. That's not to say that they're bad. They're just um, really, really lots of flavor. And I always want lots of flavor, and I sure got it with Strix. So, Strix, you guys are awesome. Thanks for the note and the coupon. I'll definitely use it to order more juice. If you want to dry tobacco, get the vanilla Bogart. I would also pick up some vanilla ice cream because you're going to probably want to thin it out or base it out with the smoothness of the ice cream. Um, same with the blue honey. It's real sweet. Uh, the banana slam is great right out, of the, right out of the box, right out of the ballpark here. Well done, Strix. Well done. This is Chris Wicks. Thanks for watching my reviews. Uh, if you have a juice that you'd like to see, let me know. Um, you can check out my other videos in the more. Just click more down there. Um, I'll have the company infos and everything. So if you want to order them, just go to more and find out the info I typed in there and uh, enjoy. But uh, thanks so much, Strix. Appreciate it. Be safe, neighbors. Take care.